Welcome back to the room two. We just arrived at this new room, let's explore it. I turned the brightness up a little bit for the game, by the way, so hopefully things will be easier to see for me and for you. It's missing the bulb for the flash. I think something goes in this gear. Some sort of a handle. Yeah, I can't touch this yet. Fifth of March, actually before that, the letterhead on it. Bailey and Sons Lawyers to the Shipping Trade. 13 King George's Gate Westminster SW1 Southwest 1 something like that 5th of March 1883 Miss Margaret Cox I am writing to you for the final time before I begin the proceedings I have brought to your attention since my brother's disappearance you have attached yourself to my mother like a leech for her sake I would prefer this to be quiet but you are a charlatan and a fraud and I will expose you as such if I must Leave her be, or else the paper has offered me a full page. Robert Bailey. The viewfinder. Probably goes in the camera. It's missing something. Voyage, temple, time. And then these slots are labeled with things as well. Temple, ship, time, null. <laughs> I don't think I can do anything with them yet. Small metal handle. This probably goes here. Oh, that's so cool. the dramatic music leading up to nothing. It's like the splitting the skull in half thing. It's gonna make quite a boom, I guess, sort of, when it actually does go off, because I think these are the old style of flashes where they're one-time use. Maggie Cox, 17 Franklin Court, London, da, da, da. for Simon, aka the Great. I wish this had a non kind of cursive y script version. <laughs> uh, what has become of you? You know I can tell when you're lying. I was the only one you could never fool. I know you have it. Have you started playing without me? Something sounds... it? It sounds magnificent. We'll be pioneers. I'll be at the Lion at nine o'clock. You'll be there. I know you. Mags. I know you have it. Are they talking about the artifact? It sounds magnificent. 
Oh, that's not pulling on a performance. That's putting on a performance, of course. Anyway, um, so there's a couple things that could potentially be used for a puzzle here. The I'll be at the lion at 9 o'clock. And then there's also this. Roman numeral 5 on the leg of this thing. What about the other leg? No, apparently just that one. Ah, it's one of those ones with an adjustable end. Well, I gotta figure out where this needs to go into first. Oh, maybe here? Hmm. No. No, that's not the right key for that. Thorn photograph behind the glass. Face is scratched out, also. Such a satisfying click noise. Don't know the order those are supposed to be in. Another Roman numeral. Oh, that probably describes the levers. Ah! A little hint that you can move this thing. piece of the photograph. If you are here, then my travels have not been in vain. If nothing else, my promise to you gave me purpose. If I was damned for trapping you here, then now I offer you my redemption. Finally, I hold the key. The secret to this world of worlds, this place of endless places, with it, you may lift the veil, peek behind the curtain. We do not have to take the path that is offered. So I found two Roman numerals. So how would these relate to the levers. We have a five and a four. Five and a four. There's eight of these. Mm, maybe it's describing which one needs to be down or which one needs to be up. Number five and four, these two. So let's try turning all the other ones up except for five and four. And then since that didn't work, let's try the reverse. Okay. That's not it. Oh, I can turn this on the camera. That's probably what this is for. Sorry for me to visualize which 
direction this key's gonna go into it. I, it should be the reverse of what I see, right? Let's just do it as it looks at first. It's actually kind of close. You know the key's in the wrong shape for the lock. Yeah, I think this one's supposed to be down because you see this piece here has a little bit sticking off the side. Which means it is reversed. Maybe I should just look at it from the other end? I don't know, it's kind of harder to interact with then. But I think that makes it a lot easier, actually. I think that's right. What's my end goal here? So I can just like move these around. Oh, I see. These are clipping in this piece. So I need to get this one unclipped, which I just did, and the other one. I see. There's a lot more on that table, but let's put this in its place first. Long metal lever. I still have this key as well. That's interesting. That must mean it's used for something else. Oh, here's another number. Two. Infinity. Infinity, what does that mean? Perhaps what am I supposed to input into this thing? What is this contraption? It's really cool. Is it some bizarre typewriter? I think so. It looks like that's paper. This looks like it might be part of it. Yes, I thought so, because it had a similar color scheme. I think I'm missing the other one too, though, right? Or maybe not. I just need the one. Can I erase? You can't really do that on typewriters. What happens when I reach the end? Oh, it just moves it up. Okay. Oh, and I can press this to move it. Just once? I guess I'll try typing infinity. Yeah, not surprisingly, it's not quite that easy. Oh, never mind. We began at home. Staring at the stars. So much to discover. So little time. Stars. That sounds related to the cards at the center table. Oh, 
Oh, I think that's another place where we can put this key. I think that'll work. So this piece needs to be on the left because it's got that bit sticking down. The short piece is on the right, the longer piece goes down. I think that's correct. And I still have the key, so there's more uses. What do I do with this thing? I see a little circle here, like something's meant to travel along these tracks. Can't seem to interact with it though. I think I'm missing an item I need. Oh, here's a bunch of Roman numerals. Oh, that's what the Roman numerals are for. They're not for the levers, they're for this. Are these supposed to be adjustable? Like, I feel like I'm supposed to be able to move these levers. Oh, well, I guess they're not levers, but these things I thought maybe were levers, so I input a password by moving it, but no. What do I do with this? There's a keyhole, but, um... Actually, maybe the key I have would work. If I put them all down, perhaps? Ah... Oh, the drawer is what Roman numeral we're setting it to. You can hear clicks as it moves from each one. Okay, well, we found three Roman numerals, so... I'm not sure about the order. But we have five down there on the leg. We have... Four here, and then two here. Uh, perhaps we should assume that this one at the top is the top one over here. This one's kind of in the middle, so it's the next one down. And that's the next one down. So, starting from the top. Two, four, five. Oh, can't reach the other handle. <laughs> Set that one first. That is so cool. Yes, the light. Bulb, I mean. Ah, now we can do this thing. Find a combination where it's going to get to its objective, right? Get down here. Is this not gravity operated? Like, is it going to be able to go down, around, down, over here, up, to the right? Actually, wait, that goes nowhere. So what good is that? Is there any way to, like, release the ball? Oh, hey. Okay, it is gravity. But it's not get it all right and then let it go. I think I need to actually flip things around while I'm using the ball. Uh, oh, it looks like you cannot change. You can't rotate the level that the ball is on. Only the others. So, if I want to get it down anywhere, it's going to have to be on the one I was just at, because that's the only one that connects here. So it has to go here. Right, that has to happen. 
And then I can change it until this goes somewhere. But don't, don't fall out. Uh oh. Um. Just hang out up there. Hmm. I think I need to rotate the top piece. Oh. We can go over here. Right. This is getting a lot more complex. Okay. Oh, I think I got it. Wait. Do I? Yeah, from here we can go up here, then I can switch this back to here, down, over. There we go. Stars were mentioned here. We began at home staring at the stars. So much to discover, so little time. Is that everything here? Almost. I think everything except this. Let's go put the flash bulb in. And then are we ready to go? Should I just press it? Oh, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Okay, so now we can do stuff with these cards. Also, we have the stars. Can I just put that wherever? Oh, they go over there. I think it's time to do that. Oh, what's this? the letter we've already seen, right? Yes. Okay, yeah, let's do the card thing. So, again it says Home, Stars, Discover, Time. Those are the keywords. Home, Stars, Discover, Time. I don't think all of those exist, but Home, Stars, there's no discover, so time. Voyage. Let's continue the story.
countless ships bore us triumphant to a hidden temple. It was at home you proved a shallow friend. Countless ships bore us triumphant to a hidden temple. It was at home you proved a shallow friend. Ships. Temple. Home? Ships, temple, home? Every time there's a new writing, I'm just praying that I can actually read it because it's cursive. Because if I can't read it, then I can't type it into this thing. <laughs> Endless. Ooh, it just wrote something invisible. <laughs> Under these alien stars, I courted only death. I am saved by science, my muse. Up, up, down, up, down, 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 up. Ah, that's for the levers. Up, up, down, up. Up, up, down, up. Wasn't that it? Oh no, I got the last four reversed. Down, 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 up. Not up, 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 down. So, stars, death, science. I think that says home. Oh, that's it? Home. No place. There's a knoll here, which makes me think that could be the no place. Oh, hey, the bell fell off. What 
What do I do with a bell? Oh. The clapper. <laughs> okay, this is a key to two different things. It'll fit this and it'll fit the shelf back there with a picture in it. Oh. Patented October 21st? Oh, I thought I had to solve it right there. Surrey Safe Company. October 91. Ah, it doesn't open the other compartment yet. Hmm, I think this goes here. Well, no. Oh! trouble figuring out where this goes. I feel like there should be an obvious... Wait. No. There we go. Is that not right? No, that's definitely correct. where the lock thing goes. Oh, it's the middle part, isn't it? Yeah, the outer part is correct. Han, or Han. Ah, oh, it locks the letter in when you start going the other direction. I see. Well, in that case... Uh oh I super went the wrong way. Oh wait, there's not the entire alphabet on each one. That's good. the null. So it was home. Nothing but null around me. Does it matter which side the null goes on? Maybe home first and then no. Home. No place. Do 
Do I need another null card? Surrounded by null and death. Null and time. Hmm. Have I exhausted everything else? I still can't get in here yet. There's nothing more to do here. Yeah, I think I just need to figure out this puzzle. Ah, I thought maybe typing null would bring me more. The null is nothing. The null is everything. Yeah, you can type a lot of things into this. Death. The worst? The worst fate is life. Oh, I was supposed to write hope. That's what it actually says inside of that box. Hope, not home. It's just that there's a lot of things you can type into this thing and it'll give you some information. The null graced me with time for a dozen lives work. Now death returns to take his due. Null, time, death. <laughs> now you see the truth of it. Time within this place works differently from without. An hour, a day, a century, who's to say? A pity. I had to wait here to see you on your final step of the journey. Everything is in readiness. Take this. Use it to find the room. Thanks, AS. alive. You are to be congratulated. You escaped the curious events of the seance with all your faculties intact. What does that name tag say there? Kelvin? Or something close to that. Man, what a cool scene. It 
Something's supposed to go inside of here. And then I think I can reel us in? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay. Yeah, those black slimy tentacle slash kind of plant vine things. We've seen that when traveling through the doors. 